When interviewed about his album Tomorrow's Harvest, Marcus Owen of Boards of Canada said that when recording, they sometimes performed into a dissected VHS deck with the motor running super slowly so you can hear all the pock marks and the dropouts on the tape. It's mono too, which gives it something special. More people should record in mono these days. I've been recording music to videotape for a while now, and in fact, all the songs on this album have at least one track bounced to VHS. What I haven't done before is compare all the different major video formats, which are VHS, SVHS, and Betamax. So I wrote this weird, apocalyptic, John Carpenter kind of 80s movie track, which sounds like this, straight out of Reaper. I usually just bounce the drums or synth lead to videotape our cassette, which adds a little dirt to the mix, but I think on this one it would be cooler if we just record the entire track to tape. Alright, here's a mono version on a dissected standard VCR. Let's try spicing it up just a little bit. now SVHS or Super VHS. And Betamax. All right, let's cycle between the tracks. And just for fun, let's use the SVHS's slow playback and mono to really get that Semina Mortbook vibe. So you can find this full track on SoundCloud and I've taken the three different video formats and split them into different sections of the song along with the original digital format. So there's four sections total. I'm kind of curious if anybody would be able to hear which section is which. Let me know.